So far this year here in Lansing, nine people have died after being shot. And now Lansing Mayor Andy Shore and Lansing Police Chief Ellery Selsby is depending on the state to step in to combat gun violence. If I could trade places with him, I would. Not a day goes by that Miranda Hinton doesn't miss her son Marcus. Marcus and his brother were shot and killed back in 2020 at a restaurant on the south side of Lansing. It's been a roller coaster up and down, up and down with the emotions, but you know, as a family, we're trying to do the best thing that you know we can to push through. The suspect, 31-year-old Zachary Diedrichs, was arrested and slapped with multiple charges. One was for carrying an illegal weapon. We found out during the court proceedings that the weapon that he used was stolen. We have an enormous amount of guns in our in our community, and we need to somehow deal with that with that problem. That problem not only being the guns themselves, but how those guns uh, are handled, who is handling them, and where they end up. Which is why Lansing Police Chief Ellery Sosby and Mayor Andy Shore are asking state legislators to pass stricter gun laws. We want to add some ideas to their list of things that they're talking about and we hope that they will strongly consider these. The list includes things like restriction of firearms in municipal buildings and other public locations, prohibiting open and concealed carry of firearms, and an act penalty for gun owners if their gun is lost or stolen and used in a crime. This isn't about legal gun owners uh, who are appropriately storing their gun and, and using it to protect themselves. This is about guns that are easily uh, stolen or lost and in the hands of those who would do harm. Chief Sosby and Mayor Shore are also proposing a safe storage law that will make it a crime if your gun isn't stored properly. Michigan recently passed a law that would go into effect in 2024 that will penalize gun owners if a minor gains access to a gun that should have been locked. The amount of guns is out there is just uh, outrageous still. Uh, but we are getting, uh, we are making the right ground in the right direction. And for those committing the crime, Miranda has a message for them. Be a leader in our community because right now that's what we need. We don't need any more gun violence or any any sort like that because look at where that has us. Now the list of suggestions have to go through city council before it goes to state lawmakers who have adjourned for the rest of the year. For now, reporting here in Lansing, I'm Larry Wallace, Fox 47 News.